this is the, the last in our series of example caricatures videos and you can see Graham has started with Miles's very strong solid hairline there we're not actually going to have a peek at Miles until the end of this video and then we'll be able to see just uh, how good a job Graham has done one thing you'll note from this different view for this particular video is we can see Graham's head bobbing up and down. He's continually looking at his subject to get good reference for what he's drawing. And there's that smudging technique, just adding in the extra amount of um, form through the, the blending of our tones. starting with the, the right hand side eyebrow which would be the subject's left eyebrow a couple of lines for the nose and then there's that shape just looking up and referencing what the subject looks like you can see from this view Graham's got plenty of pens uh, at hand on his table there making sure that uh, it's always good to have a supply you don't want to run out halfway through the job Jotting in those details, constantly referencing his sitter. Now we're going to take a closer look at the technique for doing the eyes. Notice that there's a, a line drawn just above the bottom eyelid, followed by two side lines. There it is. Two side lines the iris with the highlight and then the shadow of the upper lip you'll remember that from the other lessons that we've had looking at the detail of technique eyes and here's our our caricature you might want to also take a decent look at how that mouth has been constructed it's fairly loose it's it's not at all symmetrical the left side of it seems to be a little shorter, if you like, than the right side, but at the end of the day, are we going to notice that? No, not at all. Now, Graham has added in a bit of, bit of shadow there to sort of pull it back in visually to make it look a little more balanced. He's picked up another uh, finer nib pen just to add in some of that uh, shading, a bit of depth in the tone. And there's that that middle dimple above the upper lip, and he's now balancing out the the look of both the eyes. You'll notice also Graham has left a, a fair amount of space on the page there for for the pose and um, chatting with your subject, finding out what they're interested in, perhaps while they're at the particular event, uh, can give you some ideas for for what sort of pose to, to put them in. And the beauty of the front-on uh, view of the face is that you can fairly much place any type of pose uh, you like around a head like this. He could be moving left or right or standing still. In fact, that's exactly what Miles will be doing. And Graham is going to be drawing him holding two trays. One with a cooked chicken and one with a chicken that's still alive. I'm not sure how that uh, relates to Miles but it, would be, it is something that Graham would have found out by talking with him to discover perhaps his purpose at the event today. And he's jotting down some interesting words that uh, obviously mean something to Miles and mean a great deal to us. There's the cooked chicken appearing. A bit of steam rising up. Notice the looseness of the sketchiness of those hands. You can barely see any fingers at all. A real gesture. Very quick and sketchy. Style of drawing that really anybody can learn to master. If you were to sit there and draw with particularly strong, fiddly, fine details, 
it would take you four to five times as long to make this drawing and the overall effect would be lost because people are just going to focus on the gesture of what this caricature contains a couple of dots for the the buttons on the shirt a speed line for the ground in goes his name Miles and then just a couple of details with the permanent marker with a broader tip adding a bit more shadow here and there a bit of a thicker line around the, the jaw swapping pens back with another cryptic message that I'm sure Miles and his friends will understand Graham's signature and as I was saying this, this style of loose easy drawing is something that truly anybody can master there's nothing difficult about this it's a quick fresh easy style and can be learned by all and the best thing is it creates another happy customer like this one and there's Miles a very good likeness another very satisfied customer so what have we learned well the sketchy style with the loose details it's fast and it's easy to do now it's time to grab our pens and paper and do this exercise ourselves the instructions are in the manual